guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Thursday, May 26th. Today, June is four months old. I can't believe I had her four months ago. It feels like it was like a week or two ago. But anyways, I'll insert some pictures of her at the end. Um, but yeah, so today is Stitch Your Stash number or something. I don't forgot. But this time, I did pretty good. I used six balls up out of my stash. This yarn was sent to me. Um, while I was still pregnant and I think it was you know it was intended to make a gift you know something for the baby <laughs> so this this was six cakes of uh, mandala thick and quick how much kids just went by we're on summer break now <laughs> um, it's number six bulky super bulky there were 87 yards each I think it was 522 altogether or something like that I calculated it but now I can't remember <laughs> but um, and it's color pinwheel so it's like a rainbow color so I used all six cakes and what I made was a rug for sissy June <laughs> to lay on when she's in the floor and I do plan on putting this also underneath her jumper once she gets old enough to be in a jumper and uh, no negative comments about jumpers I know some people are against them some people are for them same with walkers but um, it's what I choose for my kids and uh, there you go <laughs> anyways here it is it's huge I won't be able to show it completely to you <laughs> but it turned out really nice I like it it kind of pulled towards the end. All, every single one of the cakes started with pink and ended with pink. It was perfect. Um, but it pulled. See, like, all these, the greens, pink, and uh, light purple was on this side. And then, like, on this side, the bluey color and orange pulled over here. I thought that was funny. But she's already been using it in Jesse too. So, um, Jesse, I noticed he was kind of wanting it. So, I'm making, I started another one for him out of Bernat Baby Blanket Yarn that I was gifted. I'll show that in another video. But, um, so I made June one and now I'm making Jessie one, but I like it a lot. It took forever and it hurt my hands and I did use a pattern for it. I can't remember now who made it, but it was called the, I think it's called the round rug. Uh, I'll link it below. I can't remember. I didn't write it down either. I gotta do that. I gotta catch up on my notebook and I did use a nine millimeter hook, which is a, I think an N hook in the U S uh, and it hurt my hands so bad. I don't, I don't like working with thick yarn and big hooks. But I did it for my kids, and I'm still doing it for Jesse. His is, uh, the yarn seems a little bit thinner. It says it's number six as well, I think. Maybe it's a five. I can't remember. But um, either way, I know he's going to like it. He'll probably use it as a blanket. But I'm going to use June's as like a rug underneath her while she's laying. She's rolling around all over the floor, so she's not going to stay on it very good. But, um, and also I'm going to use it on her jumper once we get a jumper uh, for her. But anyways, so that's what I did. I'm pretty proud of that. It took me about five days I think to make it and uh, I used up all six skeins I mean ball or cakes <laughs> there's like a scrap ball left over and it was not enough to do a whole round in the half double crochets that this is or single crochet so it's just like a scrap ball that I'll have to figure out something to do with <laughs> but I'm pretty proud of it I thought it turned out pretty good I love the colors and I actually took pictures of her for her four month pictures <laughs> uh, on on this so I think it turned out um, cute but now I have six ball bands to add to my ball band stash <laughs> so I can see just you know have a visual of how much yarn I used throughout the year uh, it's just fun to you know keep these and have them to show you know but so there's a little stack of them to put in my bag but yeah so that was my stitcher stash for this time got rid of six cakes in my stash and I'm working on another cake for the one for Jesse I have two of the I think they're like the jumbo ones of the um, Bernat baby blanket so I'm gonna use those and then if I need to make it bigger I'll have to get some more of that yarn but anyways that was my stitcher stash this time so I'm gonna hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video actually later today or right after this or something about the project bags that are going to the shop tomorrow but I'm gonna film them separately so I'm gonna hop off and get these up for you guys and I'll see you sometime over the weekend I'm sure in another video bye guys mm -hmm. 